Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be talking about how many coats of paint do you need to paint the car? Alright guys, let's just get started. If I, if I sound a little funny, it's because I'm a little bit under the weather, but let's just get to it. How many coats do I need to paint the car? Well, let me talk about that. This question has been asked several, several times, and I'll answer it. Let me just show you real quick. As you know, I'm painting this 62 Impala. Let me show you real quick what happens when you apply a lot of layers of paint and or clear. It's no good. You don't you don't have to do that. Let me show you. This is what happens, guys. Okay, this this hood right here of this Impala had so many layers of clear and so many layers of paint that it's just peeled off like if it was a a wrap, a vinyl wrap. Okay, I still have a couple of little areas that uh, are not uh, completely removed. I'm going to show you how easy it is to remove it. Now, I don't think the entire car is like this. I did find that the trunk also has this problem. But you don't do this. This is too much paint and too many layers uh, on this vehicle, which you don't need. It's not feasible it's not necessary and that's it that's how easy it's coming off okay why because it's too thick it is too many layers and it's just creating a uh, a vinyl type wrap that's all it's creating it's not getting uh, a good adhesion on the on the metal uh, now if you saw in the first video that I had several little rust areas that I circled actually these are it right here the reason I found out that this car had a lot of pain is because when I started picking that little area to reveal the rust the whole thing started coming off by itself so all it needs, it's a little scratch or anything, and it's going to peel off. There you go, you see how easy it is that it's coming out? Meaning that it's not even stuck to the panel. It's just, it's just there. It hasn't fallen off because it's completely painted, but. Now this is the rear, the trunk. I am putting some uh, body filler here that uh, was removed when I removed the paint. But let me show you how quick this one's coming out also. Here it is. I can't really do it with one hand, but that's how easy it's coming off. There you go. I am going to be checking the, the top and everything else before I continue. But going back to the first question, how many layers of paint and or clear do I need? Here we go. The answer to that question, guys, is going to be two to three coats of base. Okay, two to three coats of the color. And three to four coats of clear that is it three to four coats I usually put four coats when I'm gonna cut and buff 
you can cut and buff with three coats of clear on it you can do it perfect but that's the max that should be on your vehicle okay if you continue to apply more layers all you're doing the color is not going to get more brighter the color is not going to get more shinier all you're doing is just laying it and laying it and laying it and you're creating this I've seen it so many times I've, I've shown so many videos where the paint just peels off like if it was laminate okay this is for just the basic paint jobs guys basic paint jobs meaning uh, OEM paint jobs uh, solid metallics uh, that's what this me this amount of paint is for okay three uh, two to three coats of uh, base and uh, three to four coats of clear now there's a difference when you're doing a custom paint job there's a big big difference now you're gonna say so what's the difference the difference is that between the layers that you're applying on a custom paint job you sand it you let's say you put you apply some metal flakes you have to sand a lot of layers off you apply more you have to sand a lot of layers off and and so you keep on you're keeping on adding more and more but you're sanding in between okay I don't know if it, it makes it makes sense you're sanding in between so you're eliminating a couple of layers on every pass or on every uh, colored layer that you're applying for that special effect that you want that is different now when you're doing something like this that is just one single color you don't need that many layers so if you take your car somewhere and you're they're telling you oh don't worry I'm gonna apply eight layers of clear four layers or five layers of paint <sighs> guys that's too much that is too much material that's going into that car you do not need it all right guys now there is some paints that are not that good of coverage so you will need a little bit more that one I can justify applying four coats it should cover it if it needs more get yourself another brand of paint okay all right guys and this will be it this will be it for this video hope you guys more or less know how many how many coats of paint and clear you need on your car so that uh, you can get a good uh, a good job a good paint job all right guys thank you very much hit that like button hit that little bell icon so you can be notified whenever i upload a video and like always guys god bless